Federico Lupi played a literature professor who tries to start a new life in Common Ground 2002, a film by Adolfo Aristeran. Film Society of Lincoln Center Federico Lupi, a dignified Argentine actor well known for his complex performances in the dark fantasy films of Guillermo del Toro, died on Friday in Buenos Aires. He was 83. The cause was complications of a subdural hematoma, said his wife, the actress Susana Hornos. Mr. Luppi's career, which began in the mid-1960s, included dozens of film and television roles, often in Argentine productions. Slim and stately with a shock of white hair, he endowed his characters with a sense of gravity. One of those characters was Jesus Gree, the protagonist of the Mexican horror film Cronos 1993, Mr. Del Toro's directorial debut. In that film, which also starred Ron Perlman, Gree, an antiques dealer, finds a clockwork device that turns him into a vampire. Mr. Loopy played the monstrous Gree with touches of weakness. At one point in the film he sinks to a bathroom floor to lap up a spot of blood. Chronos trailer video by Discover 7 Films reviewing Chronos in the New York Times, Janet Maslin wrote that Mr. Del Toro had a considerable asset in Mr. Loopy, who remains suane and reasonably calm no matter what happens to him, in a role that would also have been perfect for Vincent Price. Mr. Lupi appeared in two more of Mr. Del Toro's films, both set in Franco's Spain. He was a leftist sympathizer who ran a haunted orphanage in The Devil's Backbone 2001, and the monarch of a fairy kingdom in Pan's Labyrinth 2006, which won three Academy Awards in 2007. After Mr. Lupi's death was reported, Mr. Del Toro, writing in Spanish on Twitter, called him our Olivier, our day Lewis, our genius, my dear friend. Federico Lupi Shejarido. Nuestro Olivier, Nuestro de Luis, Nuestro Genio, Mi Amigo Querido. Ombre Bueno y Leal. Adios Federico. Pic.twitter.com 54 Kybe 7 Z. Guillermo del Toro at Real GDT October 20, 2017. Federico Jose Lupi Malacalza was born on February 23, 1934, to Alberto and Clementina Malacalza, poor Italian immigrants, in Ramelo, a river town about 135 miles northwest of Buenos Aires. He studied architecture and worked in a slaughterhouse and a bank before he was able to support himself as an actor. He was blacklisted from Argentine productions for some years after he was openly critical of the government. Despite those difficulties, he remained a prolific actor, active in theater, television and film. His other films included many by the Argentine director Adolfo Aristeran. He played a demolitions expert goaded into committing fraud in time for Revenge 1981 a literature professor who tries to start a new life in Common Ground 2002 and a political idealist who organized rural shepherds in a place in the world 1992. Federico Lupi is a leftist sympathizer who ran a haunted orphanage in the Guillermo del Toro film The Devil's Backbone. Via the producers of The Devil's Backbone, he also played a doctor who becomes entangled in violent conflict in Latin America in John Sayles' Men with Guns 1997. His most recent film was Black Snow, an Argentine crime drama directed by Martin Hodara that was released this spring. He married Ms. Hornos in 2003 in Spain, where they live for a time. His survivors also include two sons, Gustavo and Leonardo Lupi, a daughter, Marcella Lupi, and five grandchildren. A version of this article appears in print on October 21, 2017, on page B7 of the New York edition with the headline Federico Lupi, 83, actor in Del Toro Films.